Alexa. So we're here with Alex Len. We're gonna ask you a handful of questions, some basketball related, some just kind of fun. What have you seen out of some of the rookies that you guys have? What kind of potential have you seen? Um, everybody came pretty ready into the training camp. I mean, the, the pre-training camp stuff, uh, a lot of athletic guys, and they, they're physically ready. And they're definitely willing to learn, and you know, just that's what you want to see. You know, the hard workers, they're willing to learn, and then you know, their body's ready. Okay, so I wanted to ask you this. I read online you did some gymnastics when you were growing up. What's that? What's that story? I'm assuming it was when you were shorter than seven feet. Definitely, so definitely. Yeah, I started. I started when I was like eight years old. Okay. But it didn't take me too long to figure out it wasn't my sport. <laughs> Because when I came in, they told me right away, I was like, look, you go, you, you're you not going to be any good. So it's just, it's, if you want to do it, it's, it's got to be for yourself. They so told I, you up front you were going to be that? Yeah. Bad? I mean, because like, I literally was the youngest and the tallest in the group. Okay. Because, you know, you, you can't be tall doing gymnastics. So, no. So I did that a couple of years and then I, I switched to basketball. Okay. Was it when you hit your growth spurt, you were like, okay, I can't do this anymore. I got to switch. Actually, one of the coaches walked in and, to, and see me. He was like, man, you, come on. You, yeah. <laughs> come over here. <laughs> you're in the wrong place. Right. Yeah. Uh, what kind of potential do you see for this team? Um, I know there's been a lot of roster turnover, but I, mean, I think the potential is like the ceiling is the, the sky. But we just gotta make sure we, you know, everybody doing their own thing, like getting better, focus on it every day, just just continue slowly to progress. And by the end of the year, you know, you never know. I think we definitely got a chance to make the playoffs. Okay, pre-game routine. Do you have any kind of thing you have to do before a game? I'm not really superstitious. I mean, I have my routine. Like, I got to eat a certain time, take a nap a certain time. But I'm not really superstitious. I don't really have, like, you know, like, the weird things that some guys right, do. Right, the like, things they have to do. Yeah, I had, like, a couple of teammates. They had, uh, like, the, exactly the same shirt, like, the undershirt. Uh-huh. Like, he, he did it for five years. Same shirt. He just washed it and just do it all over. Like, it had holes in it. Who's that? It was, I think it was Brandon Bre Knight. Okay. Yeah, they, they, that was his thing. And, you know, he... You know, <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so in your free time, what are some of your favorite things you like to do that are not basketball related? Uh, I like to watch boxing and MMA. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, um, just playing video games, you know, normal stuff. Uh, hanging out with, with my friends. I, I actually just got a pool table trying to learn how to play pool. So okay. that's another thing I'm trying, trying to get better at. Okay, awesome. Who's on your, like, your go-to playlist right now? Who are you listening to right now? It's actually uh, some Russian uh, guy. His name is Nurminsky. Okay. He just came out with an album. Yeah, so listen to him right now. Okay, cool. Awesome. Well, thanks for joining us, and we'll see you around the season. Thank you. Have a good one. Right, I guess.